Hello, Sulacock. We're up here in Chillsburg. We're here with things going on in Sulacock Facebook page. And I'm talking with Mr. Brad Logan. He's the executive director of the Chillsburg Parks and Rec. Hey, Brad. Hey, how's it going? It's good, buddy. How about you? Doing well. Is everything going good up here? It's going well. It's busy. Good. That's what we want to hear. Absolutely. I know uh, y'all got a lot of stuff going on. Yes. Let's just dive right into it and talk about it. Let, let's talk about some of these. Well, let's talk about baseball first because that's, that's the main thing coming up. Okay. And, uh Tell everybody what's, what's happening and uh, registration and you just tell them what's going okay. on up here. So we are currently registering for baseball, t-ball, and softball. And registration runs through this Saturday, February the 11th. And we, um, you can go online and register at childersburg.recdesk.com and pay using debit cards. Um, or you can come into the recreation department and register. Um, so we'll be playing Cal Ripken baseball. And then of course, later on we'll play Babe Ruth and then, you know, our girls softball league. And then of course, T-ball with three through five year olds. So. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and get that phone number out of the way, Brad. Okay. The number to the uh, Park and Recreation Center is 256-378-6225. And the email, if you have any questions, is Childersburg Parks and Rec at gmail.com. We'll make sure we mention them again at the, okay. before, at the end of the interview, but I'm talking about some other things. Okay. Uh, Y'all got a lot of things going on up here. We're trying to build a good program here um, and trying to make this back into a community center where everybody in Childersburg in the area is proud of it and trying to give them a lot of activities to, to keep people busy. That's right, keep them busy, keep them out of trouble. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, now, uh, I got a few things wrote down here, and, and uh, you can tell about when the classes are, and uh, let's start with a crochet class y'all have it. Okay, so we've had a lot of interest in a crochet class, and so we are going to start crochet, I believe it's March the 2nd, it's on a Thursday, and that is going to run every Thursday until May the 25th, and it's going to be at 1 o'clock p.m., and it's a free class, doesn't cost to attend the class. All you need to bring is a crochet hook and some yarn. Okay. And, and that's what day, what day is that on? I believe it starts February the 2nd. Okay. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. March 2nd, March which 2nd. is a uh, Thursday. Okay. And uh, how about the Zumba classes? Zumba is going fantastic. We have some great ladies leading Zumba, and they get in there, and they have a great time. Um, they meet on Tuesdays and Thursday mornings from 9 a.m. to 10 a.m., and it's, it's a low impact Zumba. So they have chairs and all that stuff. And the ladies just kind of, you know, they do what they can do. Um, but I think we've grown that to about 25 or 30 women each time. And that's a free class also. So, you know, if there's any ladies looking for something to do on Tuesday and Thursday morning, that would be perfect. How about they're having a ball? They're having a great time. Okay, now let's talk about yoga. Okay, yoga is on Wednesday nights at five o'clock. And that class is growing also. Um, they meet in the uh, meeting room up here. And in fact, had a conversation today that it's starting to grow, that they're gonna have to move out of the meeting room and we're gonna have to move into a bigger room. So, you know. That's, a, that's always a good thing, isn't it, Brad? Absolutely, that's what we want. So there is a charge for that. And I believe it's $10 a class. Okay. And you can just pay for the class each Wednesday night. Okay. Uh, Let's move on to something I just got through doing out there. Okay, I saw you and, playing. Yes, uh, pickleball on Mondays and Wednesdays. Yes. So back last fall was a year ago, um, had some guys come to us wanting to play pickleball. So we put some pickleball courts down in our gym, and they had a good group coming and playing. And then, you know, it kind of just tailed off during summer camp and basketball and all that. And so they started back. Right. And so we've got courts down, we've got nets, we have paddles, we have balls. It doesn't cost you a thing. You don't need any equipment. Um, just show up on Mondays, Mondays and, Wednesdays and Wednesdays from, from 12 to 4. 12 to 4, yes. Okay. Mondays and Wednesdays. And a um, good group of guys are in there today. And right. that's for men and women. And they have a good time doing that. We're having a blast doing it. Uh, uh, now, uh, I know basketball season's about over, but you've got open basketball coming up, right? 
Yes, we have open basketball or open gym for, um, on Tuesdays and Thursdays from 12 to 4, and that's for anyone in the community that wants to come in and play basketball. And we usually average about, I don't know, 30 kids, young adults that come in and play, and they have a great time. They divide yeah. up teams, and they'll play for three or four hours. You won't even hear a peep out of them. Okay. One more thing I got on my list. You might have some more, but uh, how about this Valentine's dance show fixing the house? Well, this Thursday, we are having a Valentine's party for ages 55 and up, and that's also free to attend. Um, it's gonna be at one o'clock in our multi-purpose room, and we're gonna have um, door prizes, and we're gonna have games, we're gonna have music, we got some entertainment. So it, it's gonna be a great, great day for the, um, for the older people in Childersburg, 55 and up, that you know just wanna get out and enjoy some company right. and have a good time. Right. Something for the seniors today. Yes, sir. All right. Uh, did we cover it all, Brad? Uh, the only thing I think that we missed is um, we're ending our basketball season this week. Uh, we started out with like 65 games and one gym. And I counted it last night, and we're down to like 16 games. So we're, we're getting there. Um, we have basketball every night this week, uh, youth basketball, and then Saturday – Games start at 9 a.m. and they'll play all day Saturday and in the season on Saturday. And then district tournament will be on February the 25th in Opelika. But there's no slack time. As soon as you finish basketball, you dive right into baseball. That's right, right into baseball and softball. Right. Yes. And um, uh, mention about baseball one more time and that phone number, Brad. Okay. So baseball registration for uh, also T ball and softball runs through this Saturday and you like I said you can go on rec desk which is childersburg.recdesk.com don't put the W's in front of it or you won't get there and you can register or you can come into the recreation center and if you have any questions you can email us at childersburgparksandrec at gmail.com or you can call us at 256-378-6225 and don't forget about the Valentine's dance coming up this Thursday and all these other things, Brad's doing a fantastic job up here. He's got this Chillersburg rock, rocking and rolling, and we appreciate everything you and your staff does. Look, it all starts and ends with, with the staff. That's right. And I've got a great staff that, that works really hard, and they're really community-oriented, and you know their goal is the same as mine, to make this place the best it can be for the people of Chillersburg. That's right. So... If you're looking for something to do right here in Chillsburg, make sure you come out here to the wreck and they'll sure hook you up. Yes, sir. Thank you, Brad. No problem. See you next time.